What up guys and welcome back to the Fit Man Cook Kitchen. For today's quickie recipe, I've got an amazing one inspired by a recent travel experience that I had. Today we are making some air fried tostones. So about two weeks ago, I was in the DR um, visiting a buddy of mine and I just happened to walk by this restaurant and it turned out to be one of the oldest in the city. So I decided to go in for lunch and I had this amazing coconut fish, which is basically like this grilled white fish. It could have been cod perhaps swimming in this vibrant red coconut sweet and savory sauce. It was just amazing. And then to accompany the meal, we had tostones. And if you've never had tostones before, let me tell you, it, they will change your life. I would compare this to, to kind of like having fries with a meal, but these are just plantains. These are not the yellow plantains, but the green plantains. And just that meal alone just reminded me how much I miss food like that. So I was inspired today to try to recreate that experience that I had recently in DR here in the Fit Man Cook Kitchen. So today we're gonna to make it some air fried tostones. Now you will need an air fryer for this recipe. If you don't have one, then you can use a regular oven. The only thing is that I can't guarantee that it's going to crisp up the same way that it would if you would use it, you know, an air fryer. But definitely you can do the same thing in your oven. You just may have to adjust the cooking temperature and also the cook time. All right guys, if you are ready to roll up your sleeves for these amazing air fried tostones, then let's get started. What is a sheep's favorite fruit? A banana. <laughs> Bad nana. <laughs> You'll laugh later. If you tell your kid, they'll probably laugh. They have a better sense of humor. All right, guys, let's go into the recipe. First thing, we are going to prep the plantain. So make sure that you get yourself a green plantain, not a yellow plantain, but a black plantain. For this recipe, get yourself a green plantain. Chop off the ends of it, just like this. And then make a really small incision right here on top. You don't want to press all the way down. This is not a power lifting exercise, it's just cooking, okay? And then grab it where you cut it and simply peel it. Take your plantain and chop it into one inch thick pieces. You don't want them too big and then add it to your bowl. Add a little bit of avocado oil or a high smoke point oil. And then sprinkle in just a little bit of salt and toss this together. Make sure every single plantain is coated in some oil. And then add them to your air fryer basket. Crank up your air fryer to about 420, that's my favorite number, and we're gonna air fry these for about six minutes. As those are frying up in the oven, let's make our seasoning for our tostones. Now, we have some warm water here. If you wanna pop this into the microwave for about a minute or so, that's fine too. And we're gonna add in a little bit of salt, sea salt. I like to use some fresh garlic, and then a little bit of onion powder. This one is optional. Tostones are really well seasoned. The plantain by itself almost has a very neutral flavor, very earthy, almost kind of like a yucca texture and flavor to it. So when you dip it into something like this and into the seasoning and then fry it again, then it emerges with a really nice garlic salty uh, flavor. Not too much, but just right. And then fresh out the oven, here are our air fried plantains. Now this is the first part of the frying. All right, now it's time to make the tostones. And to do that, what we're gonna do is you're gonna take one of your air fried plantains, place it right here, take a coffee mug or something with a flat surface just like this, and then just smash it. And you may need to wet or to oil the bottom part of the mug or your little bowl, so that way it won't stick to it and break apart. So once you do it like this, dip it into our seasoning and then put it right back into our air fryer basket. Simple, now repeat this for the entire thing. These are ready to go into the air fryer again, but we've got to add a little bit more oil so we could fry them. And what we're going to do is do a really nice, generous spray over the top, flip them over, and spray those, okay? And remember, you don't need to add any salt to these because we've already seasoned them in the water, okay? So we're going to pop these back into the air fryer for another six to seven minutes at 420. And after another six, seven minutes in the air fryer, voila! Beautiful, piping hot, crispy tostones. Wow, look at 
how crispy they are. Oh, these are always better served like fresh out of the oven, out of your air fryer. Finish them off with a little Salt Bay action, of course. Ooh, these just look amazing. But what are tostones without some nice, fresh guacamole or an avocado mash? Love it. And now for the moment that I live for, the taste test. Look how beautiful this is. Oh, sometimes I just look at food and just really admire it. And as I admire it, my, my mouth just begins to salivate. But I just love like this browning here on the back part of this tostone. It just, this makes me think that it's the real thing. I love it. Mmm. Mmm. Nailed it. But let me just get one more taste to make sure that it's shareable, because sometimes it maybe it's been a fluke. Mm. I don't know what to say. Try it out if you've never tried this before. Jesse, you gotta come try one. Bring it in. But this is a good calorie conscious version. Oh, man. That's pretty good, right? Yeah. We're, we're on Instagram at the same time. Tell, tell the people how it is, Jesse. Tell, I mean, just tell the folks. Tell them. I don't know what to tell you. You're gonna have a moment when you have these. You're gonna have a moment, You're right? Moment. You're gonna have a moment when you have these. They're that good. Look at, look at. He's having a moment right now. All right, guys. I've got to end this video because I literally am feeling the urge to eat this entire thing, and I may. But I'm gonna actually share this with the rest of the people here in the studio because. Sharing is caring and it's just that darn good. If you like videos like this, then I invite you to smash that like button below, guys. And I also want you to comment if you've ever had tostones, what is the best thing to eat with tostones? Remember to subscribe to the channel and don't forget to ring that bell so you can be notified every time we post hot content here in the kitchen like these air fried tostones. Don't walk, I want you to run out to your nearest store and get yourself an air fryer if you do not have one because it is a great investment into your health. Remember, when you look at larger purchases for your kitchen, don't look at them just as like gadgets, but look at them as an investment in your health. These are things that are gonna get you and set you on the path to making healthier and happier decisions when it comes to food. All right guys, thank y'all so much for watching. Until next time, I want you to keep it healthy, but of course, never ever bored. Ooh! Bye y'all. Well, one next. Now. You're not interested. Max isn't even interested, y'all. Too slow, sorry. <laughs>